Hey folks, welcome to another edition of Minnesota Fats. I'm your host Patrick. I got the wifey with me. We are doing a mini vacation in the Alexandria area. So we're going to go to a place called Jan's Place for breakfast. Supposedly they got good food. Let's check them out. Must expect some farmers to come here. They even got a boot scraper. Don't forget your bike lock. So here I got myself a pitcher of water and an ooey gooey caramel roll, which looks pretty amazing. Fair amount of butter. And she's wolfing down some hot chocolate that was here before he even got the ticket to the back of the booth. So I got the special of steak and eggs with hash browns. We've got sourdough toast. Pineapple juice, and she got a Spanish omelet, Mexican omelet, Santa Fe, close enough. But that baby is loaded with chicken, peppers, onion, a little bit of everything. Got that salsa going on there. So, all right. This, by the way, is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Oh, alright. So, Jan's place. Jan. Jan's place. Signs right there. Anyway. Town. That's all you need to know. Review's over. Uh, her hot cocoa was good. Lots and lots of flavor in the in the skillet omelet thing. Um, the caramel roll was actually a caramel roll. It wasn't just a biscuit with some caramel topping added. I mean, it was good. Uh, steak and eggs where do you get you know my only complaint how dare they only charge 10 bucks for the steak and eggs they they're losing money you gotta be that it was so good so good they had a little bit of seasoning on there some pepper some light salt uh just for the record, I, I don't add steak sauce or anything to my steak. I want to taste it. This thing was seasoned perfectly. I I guess I've never thought about putting pepper on a steak. Adding a dash of salt to a steak. This thing was amazing. And for that price, I'm tempted to go back in there and get two more just to go that's the other thing too we got through so we, we play cribbage in between you know when we order and you know until our food comes 
I think we got through maybe two hands of cribbage and our food was there. I couldn't believe it. Um, it was really good. On the plate, it looked like the steak was really bloody. I always get my steaks medium. There really was not that much pink in it. So, I don't know. It was just, it was just juicy. So, it's not like it was well undercooked or anything. Um, I know some people want, want their cow a little more dead than I do, but it's all good. Uh, if you're up in the Alexandria area, check this place out. It is well worth it. I, I definitely see a motorcycle trip in the future to come out here to have more food. When you look at their menu prices, it's like right away I was like, good grief, is this menu from the 90s? Look at how cheap everything is. So, check them out. You folks take care. Have a wonderful day. And may God bless.